all right hello and welcome back to another video now today we're playing the uh striker mgs first here on hurtgen forest now i'm not really sure how this video is gonna go either i'm gonna be continuing to playing my striker or maybe i get killed on my striker who knows um all that i do know now is that uh yeah, I'm going to be rushing here in between the A and B point to hopefully... Wow, okay, I got one kill. I didn't expect that one. Um, yeah, to hopefully s sneak around and get a couple kills. Now, uh, that's one there. Or actually two now. We're just going to quickly get behind this building right here. There do seem to be a number of tanks in front of us. We're going to scout them. Uh, because, you know, giving our team information is probably a better thing to do. Uh, hello, Leopard 2. I'm not sure if I should engage him, though. You know what? I will. Um, let's not go. Hello. Uh, okay. That was uh, unfortunate for him there. I am just going to run away here. And, uh, yeah, get rid of him. No, I guess... Something else that I could do is I could uh, kind of point my barrel here in this direction and if anyone pushes in front of me, I can actually kill them if I get lucky. There we go. Oh, there's a tank behind me. That's not good. Let's scout him for the team. But uh, yeah, looks like we don't make it very far. Anyway, let's see what options we actually have. Um, you know what? We're going to play the A-10. Because the A-10 uh, actually got a recent damage model change. But uh, yeah, we'll learn more about it once we get closer to the battlefield. Alright, well, we're slowly getting closer to the battlefield now. Uh, me and this other A-10 here are going to be engaging uh, ground targets. Now, there seem to be a couple here in the city. And those are probably the ones that we should be focusing on. Since we already do have a couple helicopters here. And we should probably go after targets that they can't. Uh, because first of all that'll guarantee me a kill and uh, that also means that they won't be wasting any more missiles that they don't necessarily have to uh, first tank that we're going to go after here is uh, this guy on the capture zone uh, let's just try and lock him in third person here there we go uh, let's quickly turn off now so that we don't uh, get too close to the battlefield and instead there we go very nice kill and we've also prevented the enemy team uh, from getting more spawn points looks like there's another tank there by C. I guess we can go after him uh, later. Right now, I don't quite know if they have any SPAA. I guess we'll find out pretty soon, and it looks like they do. Uh, I'm going to try and uh, sort of fly above it here. Hopefully, it just doesn't see me. Uh, in the meantime, I will get myself a um, Maverick ready. Lock him. Fire it away. And hopefully, uh, yeah, he won't be able to dodge it. There we go. Very nice. And that guarantees us at least a bit more time here in the sky. Uh, C point here is getting decapped by our team. Um, there seems to be some form of tank over here. That's an enemy plane. I'm going to go after that right after. Uh, where did it go? There it is. Uh, I guess we can ready up an aim 9 now. Launch it away. And uh, yeah, hopefully it will hit him. Now that A129 there is in danger. But I think... Oh, never mind. No luck for that A129. Looks like our missile did not reach him on time. Because he was a bit far there. And it looks like there's also an SBA shooting at us now. Now it looks like he doesn't actually have any flares. Which is good for us because, well... AIM-9Ls are... Very, uh, very easy to use and... I'm just going to shoot one towards him. My missile won't miss, and uh, yeah, there we go there. Very easy kill. Now, the A-10A late, the one which I'm playing, does get access to actually uh, four AIM-9Ls. So, yeah, that is uh, useful. Especially when there are a lot of air targets. Alright, well, there seems to be an enemy plane up. It looks like some sort of prop. We're not going to deal with that for now. Instead, we're going to deal with whatever just freshly spawned because, uh, well, it's the first thing I saw. Um, there we go. Two Mavericks. Maybe oh, only a critical hit, but at least my second one there did uh, quite a lot of damage. So we're going to do a quick 
turn around here. We're going to toggle our ballistics computer. And you know what? I think we're going to use... No, we're going to use... No. Uh, let's just, just try and use the gun and guns, actually. Although I do only have the default rounds, but at least we have tracked them now. So uh, that means that... We, uh, yeah, I have prevented him from moving. And oh wait, did he just... J out? Hmm. Whatever the case may be, there is uh, an enemy plane up and uh, also an SBA. So uh, yeah, let's get to low ground now. Uh, luckily our flares there are actually saving us. Um, so that's really good. And uh, yeah, that looks like our team has actually dealt with the SBA. Problem is that plane has since disappeared now. And uh, I can't quite find it. Oh, there he is. All right. Guess we could try and re-engage him. If the enemy uh, does not feel like it. Looks like our uh, friendly A10 is dealing with him quite nicely. But he hasn't actually killed him yet, so... Oh no, never mind. He's popping flares. Alright, well let's forget about engaging him with missiles and instead... Just, um... Oh no, we missed. That's not good. Now luckily at this close range here, the uh, flares aren't actually very viable. Of a choice and... Oh. Okay, well... That's, uh, that's fine as well. I'll count that as a maneuver kill. Or actually more of a maneuver assist. I hear another plane. Oh, there he is. Um, what is it? Um, uh, maybe a MiG-21 of sorts? I don't quite know. I'm gonna go after it. Very nice. Looks like he didn't quite see that missile coming, and even if he did, he wouldn't have been able to do much against it. Uh, anyway, let's just check the spawn here. For any new vehicles, there seem to be none. So it looks like we have won this game. Alright, well we're on a night battle here on uh, Aral Sea. Now luckily for me, I've actually... Well, the AGM-65, they're guided using a thermal signature, so they should be able to lock up to enemy tanks. With no problem. Hopefully. I don't know. Uh, there we go. It has successfully locked onto that guy, so I'll launch a missile towards him. So I can also launch one. Uh, actually, no, he's already getting swarmed by a couple people, so maybe I'll leave him alone. For now, I'll probably just start my flares and assess the battlefield from above. See what I can go after. And uh, maybe I'll also go after a helicopter, actually. That'd be a good choice. Ooh, sadly that missile there did not do any damage, uh, or at least any noticeable damage to him. That uh, is a bit unfortunate. That does occasionally happen with uh, Mavericks here. But regardless, I guess we can just, uh, yeah, fly around the battlefield here. Look for our next target. And hopefully engage him, although it looks like everyone here has kind of died. Except for this guy. Um, no, that's the wrong target. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to have to pull off for now then. And maybe go look at this helicopter instead. Now, uh, Mavericks against helicopters can work if they're not maneuvering. In this case, he doesn't really seem to be maneuvering, so I'll, I'll try it out. Uh, we'll definitely have to see how it goes, though. Oh, there we go. Very nice. Always, uh... Well, against the moving target, they may be a bit less reliable. But in this situation, they have done very, very well. Now, I don't know what tank there is here. I'll just... There we go. I think I blocked him there. So I'll just launch a missile. And very, very nice. That gives us another kill. Now, they do seem to have an LVKV up somewhere. Uh, well, I see something there. I don't know what it is. Oh, it's been bombed. Um, let's see. Where else is there a tank? There we go. Right near the airy point, there seems to be someone... So we can re-engage him here. There we go. And that should be able to hit with no problem. Very nice. I think it looks like a tank is freshly spawned in there. Oh. That is a missile. Okay. Well, um... Hopefully you have enjoyed this uh, video here. It was a bit of a short one, I guess. Well... That's why I've also included two games. In the A10, usually, um, you do get shot down after a while. 
or you don't get to spawn it in or whatever but in general it's pretty fun especially when you use a third person lock so yeah that's it for this video and hopefully you have enjoyed